Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to create logo animation for beginners in After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back and first one I will use Pinterest logo. Let's select this logo PNG layer, move to inside to my comp section and click toggle switch mode, click this icon for 3D layer. And right now go to shape layers, hold this icon, let's select this ellipse tool and let's click empty for unselect this layer and hold shift go to here make one ellipse like this and click session tool so in this time go to window enable align and select the shape layer one let's click this icon and this icon for move to center shape layer and let's open ellipse one ellipse path one and change scale like this Okay, so in this time, select this shape layer 1 and change name 3D. And also click this icon for 3D layer and open inside. As you can see here, geometry options. For this, let's go to render settings. Go to open 3D render and select render engine cinema 4D. And select the geometry options. Let's open inside and change view 1. And here change extrusion diff like this. Okay, very nice. And select this shape layer. Go to fill. And let's change color like this. Click OK. If I click zero, we can't see this stroke color. And for shadow, let's change stroke with one. And we can change color here like this click OK and select this logo layer let's link to 3D shape layer select shape layer press R open rotation and chain rotation like this OK we have two colors first fill color we can change here and second color stroke OK so let's change fill color like this click OK and chain rotation 0 ok and select this logo layer let's control D for duplicate and let's move to behind shape layer and select the shape layer let's change again rotation for C background select logo and let's select the Z axis move to back like this ok so right now we have 3D icon and chain rotation 0 let's back to active camera and select this shape layer let's make Y rotation change rotation like this and go to 3 seconds let's change quality quarter and change rotation like this let's try minus 10 or minus 20 Go to 10 frame change 10 again 10 frame change minus 5 again 10 frame change to that 5 again 10 frame change 0 select two frames make easy let's select this work area okay nice so select these all two frames let's move to the left Let's move to left more. Okay, select these first two keyframes. Let's also ease these. Go to graph editor and let's go to here. Zoom in this graph. Select first keyframe. Let's make graph like this. Okay, back to keyframes. Okay, so in this time, select the 3D layer and hold shape, press P. Go to here, make new passing keyframe, go to first second and change movement like this and move to left. Select keyframes, make easy. Let's see. Okay, let's go to here, press N for select work area. 
Okay, and select these rotations. Let's move to right. Okay, and let's move to right more. And select these two passing keyframes. Go to graph editor. And let's move to left this graph. And back to keyframes, select rotation keyframes, move to here. Okay, so in this time, go to FX preset, source effect card wipe. And let's select this card wipe, use for logo. And here, let's go to here and change this zero. Make keyframe for completion. Go to some keyframes. Let's press U for C active keyframes and change completion 100%. Let's see. Okay, so select this three layer. Go to fill and change to color black. Click OK. Nice. And right now select this logo and Go to middle, we can change random like this for random car transitions. Okay, that's good. Select two frames, make easies. And let's select first two frame, move to the left. Let's select two two frames, move to the left more. Okay, so select these two two frames, let's copy, select these logo front go to first second and control v and press u move to left let's see okay select these car two frames move to left and go to fs presses search fa glow select glow let's use for logo layer and change settings for glow. Okay, and copy glow, select this front logo, control V. And select this logo layer. Let's go to here and create new card scale keyframe. Go to back and change scale like this. And press U for C active keyframes. Select these two keyframes, make easies, and select last keyframe, move to the left. Okay, and select these two keyframes. Let's copy, select this logo front, and control V. So, finally, let's close these keyframes and create new solid layer. Add name background, click OK, move to behind, and go to Effect gradient, select gradient ramp, let's use for background and change color like this, click OK and go to ramp shape, change radial ramp and click swap colors, select this point, move to down and let's change a little bit color like this and scatter 100. So guys, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.